Let's move on to uh, the nominees for Best Actress. Huh? We have Amy Adams for American Hustle, Kate Blanchett for Blue Jasmine, Sandra Bullock for Gravity, Judy Dench for Philomena, Meryl Streep for August Osage County. I think the competition here is Blanchett and Bullock. Yeah. Am, I, am I right, Kurt? Yeah, I would say so. Yeah? They were both, you know, Kate Blanchett seems to be cleaning up this award season. Sandra Bullock has never been better than she is in this movie either. I was very surprised. She carries yeah. that whole movie. And she was really great in it, I thought. Mm -hmm. I've never been so stressed as yeah. I was watching that movie. So, you know, I consider that to be a testament to her acting. The majority of that movie, she's out of breath. I would compare her performance to, to like Leonardo DiCaprio's performance in Wolf of Wall Street. Every day, showing up to work and just being out of breath right. and screaming a lot. Doing what, drugs in space. I would yeah. vote, nice. I personally would vote for Sandra Bullock. I think the fact that literally in half the movie she has a helmet on might be a problem. I think Kate Blanchett is considered a... a <laughs> stupid things like that matter. I think Kate Blanchett is considered a slam dunk to win. Mm -hmm. For yeah. playing an unraveling woman whose husband is basically Bernie Madoff. Right. Mm -hmm. Even worse, he's Alec Baldwin. Um, <laughs> <laughs> the one who fell through the cracks here is Emma Thompson, who oh, yeah. everyone yeah. thought was gonna She's get so nominated great. for playing the nasty woman who wrote Mary Poppins. Saving Our Mr. Life. Banks really got left out of the left oh, out of the picture yeah. at this Completely Academy Award jacked. season. Right? Well, it's not that good though. No, I mean, they, but they still thought they were gonna get things. Right. They got jacked. Well, I mean, it got pushed. Well, it's Hollywood about Hollywood, and it's kind of a hagiography of Walt Disney. It leaves out that yeah. he was a homophobe, a racist, <laughs> and a basically creepy person. And props to Meryl, Meryl Streep for uh, showing up and saying that he was that in an award <laughs> right. show. I really think you that know? had an effect. Yeah, I, th I, th I think so too. I mean, I'm excited to see who wins Best Actress because I think Kate Blanchett is so good in Blue Jasmine, and Sandra Bullock is somehow the underdog in this category, you know, against Kate Blanchett. No, it's a it's a sci-fi movie, which is you know they're not the Academy's favorite yeah. genre. And yeah. I think you're right, the helmet. <laughs> the helmet. Is, that's such a weird thing. And Julia have. Roberts would be sitting there like the fake me is yeah. getting, her, <laughs> getting her second, getting her second Oscar, and I only have one. <laughs>